everyone welcome back to my channel well okay so today I've been asked to do something on sand broadcaster uh, in my previous video about a year ago I did uh, how to add your encoders today I'm going to show you how to get better quality sound and also how to add tracks to your sand broadcaster this is the version 4.2.2 and in the description below I will give you details on how to get this um, and how to set it up properly okay so uh, first of all I'm going to go to uh, the once you get it up you'll have deck A and deck B here and then what you got to do is you got to go to this equalizer button here and then here where it says equalizer AGC DSP you click AGC uh, make sure that this is what you'll see when you actually get into the window you'll see this and this so what I want you to do is you want to click on bypass all and take the tick out of gated AGC and then press OK do this with both of them and you'll find that you will have much better clearer sounds through your sound broadcaster Next, a very quick tip on how to get your tracks. You can make a new playlist. You go to right click and new and call it rock music. Spell it right. And then what you do is you click on the folder, just left click it and then go down here and add files. And on your PC somewhere you will have your your uh, your music this is just all my rock music so you just highlight all of them click shift uh, if you want to add one just click one and then open these were downloaded from YouTube and what you need to do is to take and edit these official video things out you need to right click the song go to down here to song info and you can change everything up here so I'll copy and paste that the artist is ACDC and go back and the song is Thunderstruck you want to take out official video and then click OK you'll see that it is still got that in there so what you need to do is that you go to this button here refresh so list of songs and there you have it it's changed so you can go and do this again to all the other songs if you want to make them more cleaner for when you're DJing in Second Life or wherever you're doing that. Now another quick tip is too that if you have your music files make sure that you keep them in one place because if you change your music files and put them into another folder it will not recognize where your songs come from so you have to actually put it in a place that, that this recognizes it from so you, know, you just do the artist just doing another one for you yeah so that's how you add songs and that's how you can add your folders uh, if you want to add more things to your window you can you just go to layout sorry window and you can put sound effects window in there you can put uh, where is it sound effects you can put a window up there if you wanted to um, fade control you can also put that in a window anywhere you like so if you wanted to add these you could so and then you just click that button there if you want to do that um, so that's it guys um, everything else will be in the description on how to get this I have a download for it um, and yeah all the in the description below you will see how to get the get this running and everything will be there thanks for watching